Hi, I'm Karina Gordon Barnes, and we're all about transforming a relationship that matters to you. And I'm guessing you can relate to being triggered in that relationship. So that moment where you go from zero to a hundred on the anger scale, just you know, just so like that, like oh, you're like, wow, how did that happen? Why did my buttons get pushed so quickly? You go to irritation, you go to frustration, you go to anger, annoyance. And especially if you've done a lot of personal development work, you might be feeling like, I don't want to be getting triggered like this, I should be over this. So here's one really powerful way to look at this. And I'll share it with you uh, via a story. So I was cycling along home uh, via a river, via the river in Cambridge, and the path was really narrow. And as I was cycling along, there was a woman cycling towards me. So I pulled over to the left and I stopped my bike so that she could pass safely. And she passed and she didn't look at me, she didn't acknowledge me, she didn't say thank you. And straight away I could feel that indignation. Like, how dare you? How rude. How rude. You didn't even acknowledge me or say thank you. And what happened in that moment was I made myself a victim. So this is the question that I'm sharing with you in this video. When do you make yourself a victim? And it's your thoughts that make you a victim, that position you as a victim. So in that situation with the woman, my thoughts were, she's ignoring me. She's blanking me. She's not saying thank you to me. She's being rude to me. She's dismissing me. She doesn't care about me. And you'll see that all these thoughts follow the same pattern. They do something to me. So they, and then some kind of an offence, and then here's me as the, the victim at the end of this. So catch any time you make yourself the victim with your thoughts, where you have a thought like they are doing something to me. And you can then catch this in your daily life. So just a, an example, I've just come out of my morning yoga and meditation, I'm feeling really peaceful. And I walk upstairs and there's my beloved wife, Sam. And she says to me, oh, I found some walking boots for us online. Um, they're on sale, the sale finishes today. So we need to look at them, you know, quite kind of urgently, quite time sensitive. And instantly I could feel, Ugh! oh my gosh. And so I tracked my thoughts because I know that the only reason I can feel triggered like that is when I'm believing that I'm the victim of something she's done. The only reason I can feel triggered is when I make myself a victim. So I tracked my thoughts. What was my thought? Okay, I, she's talking at me. She's pressuring me. She doesn't understand me. She doesn't know how much I've got on on my day. She doesn't understand me. And so these are the thoughts to work with. These are the thoughts that made me a victim. And it's only when I see myself as the victim that I feel triggered, that I feel hurt in that way. So this is an incredibly powerful way. If you're fed up of being triggered, go here, go to the moment when you made yourself a victim by believing those thoughts. And if you want help with this, this is what I do. I help my clients to identify very specifically what are those thoughts that cause the pain in relationship, that cause disconnect, frustration, disappointment in relationship. It's those victimizing thoughts. So I work with clients to help you identify those thoughts and then unpick them so that you're free, you're finally free of being triggered. You can just um, recover so quickly once you know what's going on. So if you're interested in that support, do book a free initial consultation and the link is just here. If you found this video useful and you feel like others would too, please share this with them. Subscribe to this YouTube channel and come over to karinagordonbarnes.com and sign up for email updates.